Yeah, lads, this is the Geordie Jedi talking about saving the Clone Wars. Star Wars The Clone Wars was a TV show and movie that ran from 2008 until 2013, just after, just before rather, the Disney takeover. Disney took over Star Wars in 2013 and among their first decisions was to cancel Star Wars The Clone Wars. A TV show that was getting better with every season. It was getting more views, more ratings, everything. It was making them loads of money. Lucasfilm. It was also winning awards. Annie's um, Television Choice Awards, everything. They were being nominated and winning so many awards. Which is rare for the, for the kind of TV show we're talking about. Anyway, it was cut to make way for Star Wars Rebels. Now I'm not saying Star Wars Rebels will be bad, personally I hope it will be incredibly good. However, they cancelled a very important TV show to a fair number of people without answering questions. Ahsoka Tano, the, essentially the main character, apart from Anakin, no idea what happens to her in the future. Captain Rex, he doesn't seem like the kind of clone that would turn on the Jedi even with um, the Lost Missions in mind. So, we don't know what happens to him. There's so many unanswered questions. Now, Dave Filoni, the director and producer, and the creator, essentially, has promised that although the TV show has stopped, information will still get through now and again. The problem is, is that information um, isn't Star Wars The Clone Wars. We wouldn't, we wouldn't mind if we got the information in comic book form or TV special form or, or even a little movie form, just TV movie, but we're after something, we want an ending and we want an appropriate ending. Anyways, there are many people, there are podcasts, there are radios such as Scum and Villainy Radio who do a podcast about it, but everybody's talk, most people who are in the Star Wars universe, who follow it regularly, are talking about Star Wars The Clone Wars and they want to save it. There's a Facebook page with a, with a, a large following, and Twitter pages with, again, large followings. There's people on Twitter who specifically talk about saving the Clone Wars every day because it is just that important to everybody. Everybody who's watched the show, show everybody who likes the show, understands what this show means for Star Wars canon or just the Star Wars universe in general because I mean where was Ahsoka Tano during the Jedi Purge during A New Hope she'll have only been in maybe her 40s during the Jedi Purge maybe even her late 30s so the, que so the question is why hasn't Star Wars The Clone Wars been saved <laughs> the answer Disney want more money they believe that Star Wars Rebels will bring them, personally, a lot more money than Clone Wars will. Now, eventually that might be true. That doesn't mean they couldn't have finished Star Wars The Clone Wars before they started with Rebels. Or even done both simultaneously and um, broadcast Star Wars The Clone Wars before Rebels. They could have done it, it wouldn't have been a problem. A bit more resources, but also would have made them a lot of money. <laughs> Star Wars The Clone Wars eventually went to Netflix, although I'm in the UK that means I can't watch it, unfortunately. And people in the US and Canada went wild for the Lost Missions. That should have been a sign to Disney that yes, they can make money from this. It will work. There are many people hoping that Netflix will do it as an original series, which again is possible. It still makes Disney money, just Netflix, Netflix do the legwork. I don't see a problem there, they make money for doing essentially nothing. They make money for saying yes, not it. Anyways, thanks for listening, I hope this gets around. Leave a like if you want, subscribe if you want. It's Geordie Jedi, may the force be with you.